Hello guys, my name is Austin, and this is my very first video. So, I am currently in thir Snapshot 13W04A. So, as you know, they've added scoreboards to the game. One thing I want wanted to do was to create a shop that you could use on your server in case you don't use the bucket one. And so I came up with this. If you, As you can see in the corner, well, the side, it says I have 40 points. So, let's say I want an invis yeah, invisibility potion. I would click this button, I get one, and I get teleported back. The reason is because of the wiring. I, because this comparator says into this block that I have to have a minimum of 10 points to receive that because I don't want to go into negative numbers and yes you can go into negative numbers and so what it does is it loops <coughs> spawns me over here so I can't run over here and reset it and mess it up because I had another design but this is a more improved one so to prove that it's one wide no five points for a golden ingot works and twenty points for a diamond oh I still have five points left over uh... let's see if I can cheat it no I cannot so I can only buy another golden ingot <clears throat> as you can see these redstone dust because the comparator it only sent targets one person the closest person so it will always do one signal strength that way it doesn't activate the other lines so let's see on how to build it. <clears throat> I'm go be sure to pause this video to see what I'm showing you. So as you can see, there's a block on the far left. That's where you activate it, and the first command block. Oh, whoops, uh, F1. And so the first one, <clears throat> you need to have scoreboard, players, remove the nearest player, and then the um, over here, score underscore uh, the name of the scoreboard underscore minimum. So they have to minimum of a certain amount of points. This one's one, and then a radius of five, so they can be four blocks away, which is a good distance. And then after that, you would put points or the number of your scoreboard, and then the amount of points you want to be removed. And then up here, what this activates is giving the player that. <clears throat> and then this has to be really long because of this inverter and you wouldn't want it to activate the line and so once it goes along keeps the signal strength the same there's a four tick delay or Peter on full full delay that activates someone being teleported back four blocks away from the maximum radius on where they can push the button so they can push the button f up to here and then they get teleported all the way back here so they can't run over there and then what this does down here is then it it activates the torch so it checks again for the nearest player within that radius and if there's no player then it just turns off so that's how it works um, thank you for watching and be sure to subscribe